What we got this time? Oh, wood elves. Yes, it's not chaos for once. Organizational details have been settled. The match can begin. It's not chaos for once. Sweet. Oh, and I've got. I actually. Oh yeah, the the the, the bets still rolling over. The bets are still rolling over. I wonder if he's got a tree man at this TV. Uh, 70,000 petty cash. Um, which is a sh shame we can't quite make it up to 100 for the bribe, but uh, looks like we go bathe then. Strength 5, strength five war dancers will ruin our day. You actually laughed out loud. That's alright. We aim to please. We Time aim to, to please. put all that training and knowledge <laughs> to the test. May Nuffle bless uh, your blocking dice. Strength 5 war dancers will ruin my day. I hope he hasn't got strength 5 war dancers. Do you know something I don't? Oh, yes, got a tree as well. Yes. Receive the ball. So at least we get to punch stuff with our death roller for, for eight turns. Hopefully. Let's have a look. Uh, no subs. He has, he's got multiple block on the tree, man. Oh, how little you know. Oh, how little you know about how glorious our death roller is. <laughs> God, what's it? Why has he got so much team value then? I don't know. Um, strip ball. This, is, this, this, this war dance is very much like, a, like good old Mr. Aubrey. Strip ball. He's got one strip ball and one tackle guard one. Okay. Um... He's got lots of guard for a Wood Elf team. I'll give him that. Nerves of Steel. That's nice. What's that guy? Straight up thrower. And no subs. I'm kind of... Oh no, his subs are over here. Yeah, no subs though. I'm kind of surprised. Mind you, he's got five rerolls. That seems excessive for a Wood Elf team. How do I get that view? Uh, you press control. Uh, if you press control once, you get their names. If you press it again, you get their skills. Uh, and then if you press it again, it goes back to normal. Has he got a strength one catcher? Where is it? Where is the strength one? Oh, he has. Oh, the four dice streak. Can you actually get four dice? I don't think you can get. I didn't even think you could get uh, four dice. No problem, Agatha. We aim to. We aim to. We aim to both entertain and educate. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not a fan of this Wood Elf team. Mainly because, one, he's got a strength one catcher running around. And two, because he's got five re-rolls. Like, why would you ever need five re-rolls on a Wood Elf team? It seems crazy. Um, but, at least we get to a... Uh, can we get one game with the with the Blood Bowl 2 camera? I, unfortunately, no, because I hate that thing. I cannot stand... Uh, I cannot stand... I really can't stand the, uh, yeah, we, educate, yes, it's a new word, just for us to, edutain, edutain's better, we aim to edutain, <laughs> um, yeah, no, I can't, I cannot stand the Blood Bowl 2 camera, I hate it with the fiery vengeance. Bob, did you know that there are all Skaven leagues played in green um, caverns under the the teams are backed by the powerful greater clans, so you have clan Skyr teams, clan Eshin teams, and so on. Uh, you lost me after Bob, Jim. Don't talk to me for the next few rounds. Okay, it's time to do some things. Six straight, okay, confirm setup. You also missed a great opportunity for a frenzy tackle, mighty blow, water sidestep, war dancer. He, did he? Oh, right. I mean, that's a good kick from him. We have to be a little bit careful here. Sweet. Uh, in that case, then, let's... Who do we want to try and score on? Probably the Blitzer, actually. He's got Agi 3. Yeah, we might, we might actually try and score on the Blitzer. Why not? 
if he catches the ball. Okay. If you would have caught the ball, you would have got your shot. But seeing as you didn't, we have no time for you. Those players oh, right. are running each other ragged, Bob. Were you much of a runner on the field? Absolutely not, Chubb. I stood on the line of scrimmage and my victim... Hold up. I mean, Purple block. I, oh, look at this. He's got two arms. Why not hit more than one target? <sighs> Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Yeah. Get down. Get down. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. Start as you mean to go on by killing stuff. Is it just you? Is it just you that likes it? Uh, yeah. Well, honestly, like I, I hate, I hate playing forty-five degrees in any game. Like I've never understood the, uh, the appeal of it. There is no game that I've ever played where I'm like, you know what? What I really need here is a forty-five degree cam. Uh, it doesn't, just doesn't work for me. Never seen multi block used on a tree. Exactly. Exactly. You just cannot cannot compete with the greatness that is a strength eight death roller. I mean it's just too good. It's it's just way too good. Um, who do we want to try and punch now, I wonder? Well, he's an Agi five guy, we'll just wrestle. Yeah, we'll have a bit of that. Uh, you are a bit old. Attacker has an assist. That's because I'm too obtuse. What? I'm not obtuse. I'm not obtuse. <laughs> set out my cage. Yeah, my, my cage is kind of set up. Knock out, and I will do nothing there. I'd rather um, I'd rather uh, like I make the blocks first because there is the chance that the uh, the sure hands pickup does not work. Um, I kind of would, yeah, I would really like to try and score on this guy, but. Miles, bearded, stunted, it's got the ball. Um, so I'm acute. <laughs> I am neither one of those angles. I am exactly, I am exactly 90 degrees. I am neither obtuse nor acute. I am right. I am right. That's what I am. I am not obtuse or acute. I am right. <laughs> uh. Oh, multi block. Multi block against the tree. So glorious. And now this tree, being a tree, is just going to lie around on the floor, uh, doing nothing forever. Yeah, strip ball. Yeah, yeah. There is that. There is definitely that. But this runner's already got so many. Mind you, it would you know what? If this if this runner actually gets to level seven, then that would be our first level seven guy. So uh So yeah, maybe we should just try and score a load of points on him. I'm two parable lines two I'm two parallel lines that are so alike but must never meet. Uh <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've never seen the. Uh, I've never. I don't watch much Family Guy. To be fair, I've never. I, I used to watch The Simpsons like for for the first God knows how many seasons, and then I, then I kind of got bored of it. And um, what's the angle called? Over two hundred seventy degrees. I don't know. Uh, They're getting up close and personal, Bob. Oh, the blood. But he's got tackle. So Damn you. Uh, smell your breath and let's see do the nothing. Dead in your um. Yeah, I don't know the uh, the over two hundred seventy degrees one. I, 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 I do know what I do know what, what you're talking about though. I can't remember. It's been a while. Um, yeah, I don't watch much Family Guy. The only the only sort of uh, Simpsons I used to watch, I never um, 
and I kind of went off it as of late. Reflex, that's it, yeah. Um, and then um, the only really cartoons that I've watched lately, or well, like adult cartoons that I've watched lately that are not anime are uh, Rick and Morty and Archer. Like, I love Rick and Morty and Archer. Apart from that. Oh, no, why would I want to do that? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, yes. Yeah. I should have, yes. I should clarify what I mean by adult cartoons. <laughs> oh, God. Just for you to pick that up too quickly. KO, good. Oh. If you look very carefully, you may be able to discern. Parts of the opposing player poking up from beneath the ladder. Just get back down. Just get back down. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to play tree. Really? Uh, Don't let them. They're massive and can take your hand right away. You are not allowed to play tree. Um. I kind of want to move the cage up here, but it's a little bit risky. What's this guy? That's just a random catcher. Yeah, you know what? This, this is... You know, uh, usually I don't like caging up like base with, with guys in base-to-base in -base contact, but... In this situation, I don't mind as much because I feel like our team's just way better than his team at the moment with this injuries already. There we go. Let's just do that and see what happens. If he does, if he does some miraculous wood elf bullshit, then so be it. Like, downloaded a Rick and Morty announcer pack for low it's super good I, I I I can imagine it would be hilarious honestly Rick and Morty is like for anyone who's never seen Rick and Morty it is proper funny like, proper just it's one of the few programs I've seen in a long time that was just made me proper like just laugh proper just laugh and like not not like a little chuckle like some there's some real funny stuff in that same as Archer Archer's got some proper proper funny stuff in it Yeah, it is hard work turning a turning a like a turning a guy into a level seven guy. It does take a lot of lot of doing, but it's just it's not anything. I suppose it just requires time. A bit of time, you're all right. Sweet. There goes one of your five re rolls. It's a good job you've got five re rolls, isn't it? I would so love jump up on this guy. Oh, look. Is that Lord down there, Bob? If this guy ever gets to level 7, he's getting... Like, I would love to roll a double and get jump up. I kind of wish I would have taken jump up instead of dodge. But never mind. Uh, right. That's a holding maneuver, if ever I saw one. You 
fired a level 6 no double scar. Oh, I can kind of see that. The players arrive to assist their teammate. Sounds uh, like a good old-fashioned fight. Do this first, I suppose. That's a solid formation. I want to see the opposing team have a go at the ball now. Together. Um. Why can I not move? What? Why? Why? Why is grab not working? Can't I move into that square? That player is looking <gasps> rather smug for remaining upright. Pride comes before the fall. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can't grab during your blitz. I remember now. That always throws me a little bit. There we go. Yes, that's right. Yeah, you are correct. Right, I see what you mean now. Yeah, that I always forget. I always forget about the interactions between grab, blitz, and sidestep and juggernaut and all that palaver. But it's okay. It's okay. This player likes to be well assisted. Oh, the two dice. Pow. Damn. Strength one, guys. Just oh. Nope, you can't stand up. There is no standing up for you, tree. You're just going to be useless for the rest of the half. Oh, this see, this is <laughs> Juggernaut is probably the most underrated strength skill. Yeah, Juggernaut is a huge help a lot of the time on a lot of pieces. They've gone into the opponent's tackle zone. They should be good. You, nice, nice. Uh, you know what? <laughs> Agatir, you're actually paying attention, so you're probably a lot better off than I am. <laughs> you are. You're actually learning stuff. I keep doing this stuff and not remembering. Oh, never mind. I thought we could, thought we could, uh, thought we could survive another one. You. You are getting punched so hard. Diving tackle. Diving tackle. Diving tackle. Stand up, right. Kind of want you stand up. All of a sudden, I've got. Oh, it's just all level one guys. Hmm. Three dice, that guy. Yeah, why not? Why not? Will the big one manage to lay out an opponent of half his strength? Oh, you had your chance. You had your chance. Good old death roller.
Uh, you can go there just in case there are any leap shenanigans. Poor. What's the secret weapon weight on the big gun? Is it even comparable? Oh, uh, uh. <laughs> God, this tree. This tree. Yes, that's it, tree. You level three. <laughs> I can't believe you went multi multiple block first. He's, he's probably like, I'm only going to get one chance to hit stuff. I might as well hit two things at once. <laughs> uh, I don't. I certainly don't blame him. Poor sod. That's it. Get in their face. Unity is strength. That works. So there goes all these blocks. It's actually. I was going to say he's actually. I. I'm not. I don't actually. Oh, strength four troll slayer injured by a wood elf. No long term. Okay. Uh, let's we'll skip. Never mind. Never mind, troll slayer. Would Juggernaut cancel the rest of the fuel the one getting blocked? I don't think so, because I think Juggernaut only... Oh, you mean... Right, I see what you mean. Well, if you had Wrestle and they had Juggernaut and they blitzed you... I don't know. Yeah, that would be a bit of a weird one. That would indeed be a bit of a weird one. God, losing that Troll Slayer hurts. But it actually hurts less than, say, losing the... Uh... An awful attempt at a dodge, but a spectacular dive. It hurts much less than losing the... Um... Losing, like, a tackle piece. At this point, losing a tackle piece would probably hurt more than losing the Troll Slayer. I've got tackle. So you're a, you're a guy. You're the guy that we're just going to punch stuff with all day. Uh, I feel like if we get rid of these guard pieces, then he's in a world of trouble. They're gathering around that lone player, like halflings round a sandwich. <laughs> Well, yeah, no, that's, yeah, I know. I don't get me wrong. I know we have a bunch of tackle pieces, but out of all, out of all the pieces we could lose, this one doesn't have tackle. So while it's, what I mean is, while it's, while it's harsh to lose the strength four guy against this team, it doesn't actually make that much of a difference. Is what I was getting. God damn you. The reason I'm leaving this guy down here is because on the off chance he manages to do some ridiculous wood elf stuff and get like a leap in here and whatnot, one dice blitz, whatever. Like I don't want him to be able to then throw the ball downfield easily to the catcher. That's the only reason why I'd, I, I figure I'll leave diving tackle guy down here and see what happens. Okay, so he's got no reroll, and we do have sure hands, but he does have strip ball. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Now the ball bounces around a bit, which could be bad for us. Oh, 
block on the ball carrier. Oh no, because yeah, sorry. No, we have the uh you can do a the short hands. <laughs> That's kind of the point. Which is good. Which is good. That guy got guard? No. That guy doesn't. That guy doesn't. Right, um, what do I want to do here? Big guy, trample all over him. Yeah. It reminds me of the famous story of Nerdling and the Great Unclean. But this time, no miracles. <laughs> Okay. I feel like we definitely could have injured more elves, but on the whole, not too bad. Problem is, like, we need to enter at least one more to make the numbers even. Because our death roll is going to go off the pitch at half time. So we were kind of banking on being able to injure at least two elves. Um, not being able to injure two of them is a bit of a pain. The attacker has an assist. Oh, does it work like that then? I can dodge into any cage on a 2+. plus. That's, that's sweet. I like that. I do like that. Take root. <laughs> God, this tree. Now we're going to need a lumberjack. This tree. So I assume he's going to try and... Okay. Ultimate weapon of a war dancer 
his powerful spring. Nice. That guy was annoying. I want a nigger as well. So there goes his apo. There goes his apo. Ah, oh, no cash. Okay. Well, no cash sucks a little bit, but certainly not the worst thing in the world. Okay. I feel reasonably comfortable at our chances to score here. I mean, even if... Even if we have to make a dodge. I mean, this is an Agi 4 dwarf, so... As long as we keep our reroll, we should be alright. Those players are very close. Smells like a fight is about to happen. So you can get two dice with the thrower, but the thrower's got no block or anything. So that's, it's, even that's not the safest or not the easiest block in the world to make. Is the assist gonna be enough no to cash, more like top. we get to hit him again. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Oh, he's got. So he doesn't have. He has four re rolls and leader, which is what. So he can get two dice now, actually. He could... Yeah, he could put this guy in here and then dodge out and around and block this way for two dice. Hopefully we could recover the ball if that happens. He doesn't have block. So there goes the reroll, which is good. And he doesn't have block, which is also, also works in our favour. All this focus on the ball and the Ah, but he rolled the, the rolled the defender stumble. Okay. Offend helps though. Not, not far from the end zone. The thing to do here would probably be to just engineer a gap and hand it to the blitzer. Like we could pr pretty easily blitz this guy away. Yeah, okay. We're gonna need to make a. We're gonna need to make um. We're gonna need to make a handoff to the Agi three guy. That's basically what it's gonna come down to. If we can make the if we can make the handoff, we should be okay. If we don't make the handoff, we might be in a bit of trouble. Fantastic flying tackle. Yeah, it is. It's going to be a handoff to good old. Uh, a handoff. To, well, it's going to be a handoff to Vorkos, actually. I, don't, I mean, we should. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, that actually works. Because as long as he's on the floor, we don't actually care. Right.
Sometimes the underdog wins the Not this time. Where's the uh, good old? Oh, he's in there. Okay, so who do we want to give it to? The runner, or do we want to give it to one, two, three, four, five? No, we want to give it to the runner because the runner doesn't need to make go for it. Stick him in there just to be on the safe side. You go there. in the dwarf's rather big and ungainly hands. Okay. 67% with a reroll. Okay, well there we go then. So we don't score. Oh well. Never mind. Sucks a little bit, but... Oh, this has been a bit of a crappy half. I mean, we did burn his apo, so we did technically have two injuries, but um, yeah, I thought we I thought we could have easily made that. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Just got to hope we can put the heart on him. Put the hurt on him second half. And we, ideally, we want a couple, like at least one of these KOs not to come back just to keep the numbers even. Um, but we will see. We will see. God, what did we roll? Catch three plus two, catch three plus one. Oh, that hurts. That hurts. This head forgot his hands in the changing rooms. Were they asleep then? But to be fair, we did kind of, um, you know, the reason that came about is because we left him an opportunity. Like, he, he made an opportunity to two dice block the ball carrier. Okay, so we're even numbers. Uh, we're even in numbers, which is good. They simply have a better dock. Well, actually, are we even in numbers? Yeah, I think we are even in numbers because They're he has two off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two. Five, it's time for one of seven, us to yeah, step okay. up and be a So we should have nine each. Good boy. You've done a good job. Now go watch the end of the match from the bench. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, bashing the bashing the cage is a uh, bashing the cage, uh, get, getting the cage to the stage where he could two dice by the ball carrier. That that was my fault. So it's, again. I am always the first to hold my hands up and say, you know what, we could have done it better. Like, that's not to say that, you know, we shouldn't have been able to make a 3-plus with a reroll. But, it is what it is. Like, we we could have done that a little bit better. We definitely could have done that a little bit better. Uh, on, my de on my death roll, it's next level up. If we get doubles, do we get sneaky, get pro or tackle? Pro might not be the worst idea of the world, although it's very rare that we ever need to re-roll on the death roller, purely because of the fact that he, he gets three dice most of the time. So, Pro would probably be great on any other big guy, but on this one specifically, it's probably not the best thing in the world. Sneaky Git is definitely would be fun. Um, sneaky Git would definitely be fun. I could definitely see Sneaky Git working out. Um, strength eight blodge. Yeah, I mean, dodge dodge could definitely be a way to go. Dodge just makes it so that like we just get extra re rolls on breaking on breaking tackles and going into cages and stuff. Like if we had dodge, it's not often that the dodge is going to work, but we could just we could do it. We could. I don't know. I don't know. It would be it would probably be a choice between dodge tackle or I don't know what else I probably wouldn't go pro just because 
like how often have we ever failed a, a like since we got strength eight how often have we failed a block on the on a death roller it, it doesn't happen like it really it's very rare that we fail blocks on a death roller oh come on game another player on the ground at least it was a stun at least it was a stun dodge and dodge with break tackle is two two pluses Oh, does dodge work? Oh, right. Okay. So does dodge, dodge make it so that you literally get your break tackle twice? Because I thought the way it worked was um, that you make the dodge roll, and if you fail the dodge roll, like you try and dodge with your Raji. And if you fail it, you try and dodge with your strength. Well, some weird... Someone explained it to me in a weird way. But if you just make... If it's literally just like... You get to try and break tackle twice. Then yeah, I would probably take dodge. That would be... Uh, that would be amazing. That definitely seems like it would be fun times. The bigger they are, the harder they punch. Um, yeah, they have got they have got animations for a leaping death roller. They've also got animations for a leaping tree man, which is just as hilarious. If you fail a dodge roll, it would apply. It. If not, it uses the dodge reroll. Oh, okay, so it basically goes try and dodge, use break tackle. Oh, that all failed, so I'm going to use the dodge reroll, and then apply break tackle again. Okay. Sounds like fun. That sounds like fun. Yeah, dodge might be a dodge might be a good shout. They must have glue on their fingers. Trying to secure the ball. Nice. That's been practiced on the training field more than a few times. Tree touchdown. Oh god. He got a tree touchdown the other day. That is glorious. That is glorious. I can't wait for a I can't wait for a corn to be in the game so you can have bloodthirst touchdown animations. That would be great. That one's got fists bigger than oh. half joints. This tree. With arms like three points. There was only going to be one result in that spot. Where's a... Did diving tackle guy go off the pitches? Oh no, there is. Where's one? Did we lose a diving tackle? No. I think one of them must have died against the Chaos teams. 
the crocs pile yeah i think we've seen the crocs piling on animation i'm pretty sure someone played it against us and that, that is pretty good as well the crocs piling on animation is pretty glorious <laughs> With arms like tree trunks, yeah, indeed. Another handoff. It's like past the parcel down there. Successful handoff. I like what I'm seeing. Hmm. You're passing the ball back. Interesting. So. He's farming them SPPs. Okay. I knew he was going to roll the one because we did a go for it. Okay. If this uh if this tree takes root at any point, then we might be alright. Huh. Safety in numbers. This is going to be decisive. Oh the pounds. I was hoping we'd get both down there, so they'd have to use wrestle, but never mind. Take root? No, no, no. Or the merrier. That works, though. With fists flailing, he's following up, hoping to get the knockdown next time. Well, that was a little bit risky. Solid hand. These two players work well together. And that's the ball going the wrong way. No! Over on the other side! Over the other! Oh, 
Come on, Jane. Get him off the pitch. Stunned. No. There we go. KO always helps. I think there was a Blood Bowl player under this other one. Knockout! Yeah, he's trying to farm S. I don't know. I don't know why he's so con intent on. I mean, he, he clearly wants to level up the catcher, but he seems to have invested a lot into leveling up the catcher. Uh, why is it this tree never takes root or anything? Our tree takes root all the time. If he keeps messing around down here, though, he's slowly going to lose. What next? Lose people to pass it to. Push kind of helps. <laughs> I'd very much like him to foul one of these dodges at some point. That would be nice. Just take nothing but trees so you can roleplay as a forest. Yeah, that sounds like a horrible idea. Nice. <laughs> oh, never mind. Okay. Take that with your rubbish strength one. I can't connect to a game at a crucial level until it has at least one fatality. He doesn't have gold. There we go. There we go. Would have pressed the blitz up the field, but you mean this guy? Yeah, maybe, maybe.
So if he goes down here, he gets, what, one dice here? If he goes in here, he gets... Now that's a holding maneuver, if ever I saw one. This is going to be decisive. Okay. That works, though. Take a push. He's invested a lot of time and effort into clearing this out, but not a wise place to end your turn on the border of the power. If the player gets pushed into a crowd, well, last time that happened, it took three days to piece the body back together. God, why did you never? T there we go. Fell the low nut, and we're golden. You just foul the loner, we're golden. Sweet. We are in a real good we're in a good real good spot now. I feel like. Alright, what do we want to do first? Um Is about to get punched above and below the belt at the same time. Takes a skillful player to stay up under such a state. Nothing must be holding him up. That actually makes things a little bit worse. Likes to be well assisted in a fight. Look at all those men sitting down. There'll be trouble with the unions if this can. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Probably in a bit of a worse spot now than we were because we didn't get knockdowns. But either way, if we can get a, if we can get a couple of elves off the pitch, we might be alright. It's this this pass is not going to be easy with this guy as well. Like it's actually four, but it's still going to be a reasonably long pass no matter which way he does it. Oh yeah, he almost certainly will try to pass. It's just a case of to who. Um, The good thing is he can't he can't actually hand off to anyone to make the pass any shorter. I mean he could try I don't know. I don't know. Either way the, the pass is gonna be the pass is gonna be pretty long. And he's gonna have to pass it he's gonna have to do either a really long pass or pass it to someone in a tackle zone. But we'll see. We will see. Which one of these is that's actually four dwarf. They're gathering around that lone player. Like halflings round a sandwich. Ah! I've seen bread and pressure more easily than that kid's head. Yeah, I mean this is off this is an awfully long way to pass it. From here. It's easily, I mean, he is elves. It's easily doable. Can this guy actually catch it? No, this guy can't catch him either. But we can get diving tackle on him. But then again, he could just use leap. So, I don't know. 
we kind of need him to fail one of these dodges at some point to make life easier for us, but... This be the problem with the elves, though. They can just do elf stuff. This is the important part. We need him to fail the pass. The tree is Lucius. Lu useless. Yeah, tree is always useless, though. In, in every, like... The tree is... I hate the tree. Like, we play with one, and he causes me so many problems. It's unbelievable. Here comes the last chance. Ah, oh, just straight up did it. Never mind. Get something All right. Or score a touchdown. Well, we're probably kind of boned now. Which one? Yeah, we're probably kind of boned. Okay then, let's see what we can do. Oh god. Ah, sorry. Ouch! That must have hurt. Did he finally go for it? He did. Oh well. Yeah, this is a. Can I just score in two turns? Um, maybe. I mean, nah. I mean, honestly, at this point, after this, the way the first half ended and the way that this half has gone, we were more just like we were kind of playing for a draw. Once he makes the pass, we're kind of playing for a draw. Like there wasn't really much else we could do. Well done. It sucks to lose a game this way, but what can you do? What can you do? <laughs> Remember when you was the richest guy in chat for two hours? And we would have what? I mean, we could probably score in two turns if he scores now. I mean, he's making a bunch of dodges again, like which just seems like a really bad idea. If I was him, I would have just scored and and tried to tried to stop me from scoring in two turns. There we go. Okay. So two turns. It can be done. The Blitzers can make it in two turns. Especially against an elf team that has somewhat... Um, somewhat fewer numbers. It's a shame he got his KOs back. Yeah, it might be a little bit hard because he got his KOs back as well. But it can definitely be done. It can definitely be done. Uh, movement 6, movement 5. Yeah, we just have to try and get it to the runner. can definitely be done. He's actually just going to defend really deep. Okay, seems a bit weird. With the runner, we only need one go for it. Yeah, it can definitely be done. It can def it's more protecting the runner is going to be the awkward part, but uh, we can definitely do it. 
Especially because we should be able to get it to him reasonably quickly with the... Uh... The problem is, even though we only need one going for it with the runner, we're going to need a bunch more going for it to get other people to protect him, which is the problem. It's not so much the runner getting there, it's everyone getting there at the same time. If that makes any sense. Like, I could I could quite easily run the, run the runner seven spaces, but then everyone else is going to have to make, like, two, three going for it just to catch up with it. Sideline YOLO cage. Yeah, that is probably the route we're going to go. That is probably the route we are going to go. Now, that side's got a catcher on it. And that side's got the thrower on it. So, we'll go down this side. Be gone, fell demon. Problem, Bob? Plague fly in my coffee. Are you going there? You need to go to open this up. Movement five, movement four. Okay. okay. Let's see what happens. Just play go the distance card. <laughs> that would be nice. This actually worked out right. That works out right too. Touchdowns are coming. The studio wizard has promised me at least one more before the final whistle. Right, first things first. Please no one. Oh, what's the actually what's the It's a it's a one either way. So we don't actually need to make any... That's a dangerous place to be. Uh, yeah, we're still going to have one more reroll left, so I might as well. Okay. Let's see what happens then. Let's see what happens. If the player is pushed here, it will finish in the public. And in general, fans are much more dangerous than players. So he's going to try and scream. Okay.
Game. Hilarious. Yeah, of course. Why not? Why not? Never mind. Ugh, why not? Good defensive block. Ugh, game. Why you hate me? Man foul the war dancer. No, we're gonna we're actually gonna try and score. We are gonna try and score. Um it's not gonna be easy, but we're gonna try it anyway. Oh well this game sucked. Um but what would be the best way to do it? I want to get that guy so we can go. Mm. There is no easy way. Good. On. He's dead, Jim, but not as we know. Sorry. Oh. That hidden, hidden going for it modifier. The dwarf player has just picked up the ball. That's not their style. Never mind. We could have scored, maybe, but yeah, too dead. Like that game was just. Honestly, and again, I will reiterate that a little bit like some of that was our own fault because we got our cage blitzed. But between failing the like failing the handoff at the end of the first half, and then him doing that pass stuff for the, at the in the middle of the second half, losing that one was a little bit harsh. A little bit harsh. Uh, right, troll slayer, level up, roll the dice. <sighs> Gonna take jump up while I get the chance. And you. What do we want to do with this guy? What have we got on our other runner? We have got. Block leader. Um. Block leader. I don't know what we what we should get on the runner. Um, I'm tempted to go. I don't know. I'm tempted to go. F kick off return again. Strip ball runner. Strip ball runner could work if we go strip ball and then. I don't know if I was going to go strip ball though. I probably should have taken wrestle on him instead of block. We do have kick. We have a long beard. We kick somewhere. Uh, I know. Yes, we do. We have kick there. We've got kick already. Um, I don't know. Don't really need more tackle. Never went onto the field without a pair of orchidas on my feet. They're the only ones. You know what? Actually, we could theoretically 
We could take pass because we have an Agi 4 runner. We could take pass in case we ever need to pass it to this guy. And then we could start using this guy to carry the ball and this guy to run around doing things. Strip ball. Yeah, like someone said strip ball. Like strip ball would have been good, but if I was going to go strip ball, I probably should have taken wrestle. Um, although we don't actually have any strip ball, so maybe... Maybe, maybe at least one strip ball player would be good. Dump off could work. Although dump off is... Like you can only throw quick passes. So that would mean we'd have to have the other guy... Stood right next to him all the time. And if you're going to take dump off. I always feel like you kind of need Nerza still afterwards. Um, maybe we will go... Maybe we will go strip ball. We don't have any strip ball players. So maybe I will go strip ball on one. Yeah. I just like the idea of a passing dwarf team. I really do. You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. It's going to it's going to be like our orc team. We're going to have a we're going to have a runner a runner throw the ball around. Have you looked at Face Tome recently, Bob? Did you know you have a fan club? We're going to do this. We're going to do this. We're going to we're going to be a bit uh a petition to remove you from the air. A bit fruity. A bit fruity with the dwarves. 